Hello, today I am going to show you that uh, how to find the relevant gene information against a probe ID. Like here you can see that this is just one example of a file I downloaded from uh, GEO and CBI which contains the expression information of probe IDs like these are the probes. So how can you get the information of the genes against these probe IDs because uh, sometimes you don't want to do the whole analysis of each of the all of the genes you just want to look for one gene so what you can do is you can go here on geo and cbi like i just want to show you from where you can download this expression information just type any thing like i typed here breast cancer and then you can see that there are a lot of different studies which are of expression profiling in high throughput but um, Nitroport is for sequencing, but I'm clicking here expression profiling. Like you can see here that it's expression profiling. So this is the top one just came up and I just show you like, hey, this is the series matrix file. So this is the series matrix file, the processed file of all the expression information like this one. This is of some other array, but this is for the uh, any other study just I showed you. So if now if you want to extract, you have to go to ensemble select the uh, ensemble genes and human and then uh, what you can see is that against those probe ids you can go here and you can type the gene name and you can find what are the names of the probes like if you uh, want to know that the expression of some genes so what you do is you go on the filters and on filters you select the gene name for example here I'm selecting HGNC symbol. HGNC symbol is the official gene symbol of any particular gene. So I want to filter based on a gene uh, name like TP53. So if I zoom it in, if you want to see like TP53, like this. And now I want to see the attributes against it. So what I want to know here is the attribute that is the probe ID. So I want I can know that which gene against which probe. So there are different microarray probes information here. So what I download I showed you was the FA matrix, but the, from the GNCBI what I showed was for any other one. So let's see here it's if I go and I click another one. Uh, no, again, this one is Agilent. So let's see, let's see this one, Agilent. So for Agilent, I go here and there are a lot of different probe types for different array, uh, Agilent arrays. And this one is 44 into 44K V2. And if you see here, this is 4 into 44K V2, this one. So I will select this one and keep those information which I know and I want like there are a lot of things which are clicked some stable ID stable ID version transcript table so I just need the gene stable ID so click the results and now you can see that these are the genes IDs and the probe IDs of TP53 so it will be very easy like you go there you download the download the uh, series matrix file and you want to know the the gene name against that probe which can be easily downloaded from here so these are the two probes so now you can filter out the information based on your gene of interest you just select these probes and you know that these are for the tp53 gene so that's one example how to extra go quickly and find the relevant information thank you bye bye